Okay, you ask for it and you shall receive it. This is my Leto Vandal build. First off, let's show you the damage before we show you anything else. The Leto Vandal is, of course, one of the very first weapons you're going to see. I mean, not the Leto Vandal, the normal Leto. And the Leto Vandal is, of course, just an upgraded version. It is an AoE headshotting weapon that is, of course, slash based. Look at that. My build primarily focuses on viral heat. And in incarnate mode, it does tons of damage. Yep, look at the damage right there. Easy damages. Okay, let's show you the build very quickly. Um, a lot of people ask for the later build, so of course I'm going to be showing you. Let's go and show you the evolutions first. Evolution 1 is of course the punch through and ricochet you there's really no other option for here uh you get incarnate charges by headshotting remember that with secondary dead head you get more damage by headshotting so that's a good pair up with this weapon the second evolution is of course out of the two we chose the heaven for a it increases your damage by 22 and with over shields it increases your damage by another 40 the other one of course is a basic damage um evolution 2 but instead of over shields it is reload from empty magazine now this might be good but the leto has high magazine capacity so I don't know if it's more efficient to pick this one, but I'm playing a vault whenever I use this weapon. So, overshields are basically 100% up. So, I picked Heaven for Ray. But if you want the gameplay of just unloading your clip, then pick this evolution instead i'm just not really that comfortable with not reloading that much okay third evolution very quick very quick out of the three we picked void guidance void guidance increases your accuracy and reduces your recoil by 50 um the other two of course is better for damage uh this one has 50 percent chance of instant reload reload not really that good to pair with the other um other evolution here but it might be good if you want but keep in mind this only works for the non-incarnate version it doesn't really reload your incarnate version it doesn't really give you more ammo for that so this one is basically useless if you are doing an incarnate mode build marksman's gain gives you more ammo efficiency i want you to remember as well that this doesn't proc for the incarnate form so if you're doing an incarnate build, do, both of these are basically essentially useless. You're going to be picking this one. Accuracy and Redos Recoil. For the third one, we're picking the double increase for critical chance and status chance. Mostly because the base Leto has good status and you can use that. Uh, of course, you could also do the other one that equips from primary and gives you more crit chance. That's going to give you some orange crits and the other one the plus direct damage per status type if you're using like a lavos or something that might be good but if you are asking what's the most general best evolution for the leto vandal i'm always gonna be recommending survivor's edge 10 out of 10 times maybe 9 out of 10 times it depends on the build but yeah survivor's edge is the best pick here let's show you the mods here <coughs> pretty basic mod build uh heat viral for your secondary you see this in almost any secondary out there galvanized diffusion for more multi-shot on kill it stacks up to four times 30 times 4 3 6 9 12 and then add the additional 110 that's a lot of multi-shot already. Galvanized crosshairs. Remember, headshotting. We're going to be headshotting a lot of people. So, might as well just take advantage of that. Every time we headshot, we add more crit chance 
to our weapon so that's very very nice got a nice shot every time we kill an, an enemy we get more status chance and more direct damage you know it's like the same evolution without the drawbacks here you don't need extra statuses so that's good and of course prime target tracker and prime heated charge prime target tracker for more crit damage prime heated charge for more heat you're gonna be putting this in the last slot though every time because you want your viral your two viral mods to be connected um pistol pestilence for 60 percent toxin and 60 percent status chance and of course frostbite for 60 percent status chance and 60 percent cold it could be either way it's still gonna be a viral build just don't put the the prime heated charge before the other two because it's gonna destroy the elemental combination and of course last but not the least little torrent for more fire rate and for more multi-shot um you really don't need an exilus mod for this weapon but i had an exilus uh, adapter lying around i'm sorry i was like might as well we had steady hands here of course there are other more uh there are other better uh exilus mods here we could use probably pistol ammo mutation if you're having a hard time with ammo but other than that in the secondary division of exiluses they don't really have vigilante sets so it's really not needed and of course the arcane the arcane is the secondary deadhead i just said this for the like third time this video we're gonna be headshotting a lot of enemies and with that it's almost a hundred percent uptime for the damage stack here remember that we also have 30 percent plus on our headshot multiplier and 50 per my plus uh, minus 50 percent weapon recoil if it's on rank five in stacks three times 120 percent for 24 seconds stacks for three times 120 240 360 percent damage it's basically another serration mod so this is such a good such a good arcane for this weapon let's show you again one more time how good it is on uh i'm feeling a bit spicy right now let's do grenier battle group get oh get some few headshots here okay open your incarnate mode boom 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 oh what the fuck okay boom 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 look at that that was three shots boom 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 because of the ricochet it's ricocheting on almost every enemy of course my panzer vulpapaila is also viraling the enemy so they were doing even more damage and look at that they're all just destroyed now i don't want to headshot stuff uh, uh, well, how's the damage if you're not headshotting okay let's see the damage without headshotting uh, of course you'll need to headshot for the incarnon but let's not aim on the head this time let's just spam Look at that. I'll get, get more headshots. And then spam in the body. We're still we're still doing tons of damage. Remember, this is level 225 steel pot enemies. So if you're doing basic um basic lit lit or meso neo axi relics on the star chart, this is easy PC. You're one-shotting every enemy. Anyways, I'm gonna be ending the video right there. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the uh what what is this again a delay to vandal build i changed the name to end so that you could like and subscribe but other than that i'm gonna see you guys in the next one don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below if you want the Bratton build i'm gonna see you guys later peace out